How's things? Going. Hey, V. Claire, right? You come to talk about my offer? Yeah, let's talk street racing. Sure, but not here. It's mayhem. I'll be at my garage after my shift. Swing by? No. Sure. Talk there. Have a good one. Hey, lover boy. You're spilling. Yeah, you. Drench the whole bar. Just get your drunk butt home. Yeah, yeah. No. This trouble? The net around me? You will fit. You know it. I lost everything. Let me be you. plain again. Solve your own problems. Clean up you your own shit. Will? Go fuck yourself. Be careful who you bargain with. Okay. Need a fixer. Got something that can't wait. Let him in. Hmm. Not here. Not there. Who are you? Name's V. And what is it you want, V? All these years, it's really her. Fucking bro, just kicking it back on a couch at the afterlife. Don't mess with her, she's got MRI. See right through you. Give her the truth. The girl. What was her gripe? Why didn't you ask her? Might still be around, sniveling in a corner. Need your services. Gotta track a guy down. Mm-hmm. Anders Hellman. Hotshot engineer. Worked for Arasaka. Millisec. Anders Hellman. Pinpoint him for me? Huh. <laughs> Thanks. Jump in too soon. First, my help's got a price. Second and third, Dexter Deshawn, Jackie Wells, T-Bone. Multiple bells ringing, V. Left a lot of bodies behind. Death walks in your wake. Chalk that up to bad luck? There's the bitch I know. Ask her about Sokka Tower. How they shot me up right in front of her. Wanna go through obits? Really? Fine. Johnny Silverhand, zeroed inside our Sokka Tower, before your very eyes. Got more if you want. Or we could just talk. Got balls on you, boy. Don't like that on everybody, but they seem to suit you. Anyways, feelings be damned, I've always said. This is pure biz. You need my help, so get those eddies ready. Mm -hmm. See? Should be enough. Mm-hmm. Come back tomorrow. Business opportunity. Cargo transport. Get from A to B, quick and quiet. Interested? You want to run this by a fixer first. Fuck the middleman. They're cash drained. Attitude like that won't get you far in this line of work. I don't need a consultant. I need a transporter. Will you do it or not? I'm listening. It's simple. You go to the Kabuki waterfront, collect the package, give me a call, then I tell you how to deliver it. Very straightforward. Yeah. Everything except my pay. Don't worry, there's a bonus in it for you. Imported and duty-free. Duty-free and detail-free. Yes, but altogether fair. It's a simple job, generously compensated. Do you accept? Yeah, sure, I'm in. Good, I knew we'd find acceptable terms. Head to the Kabuki waterfront, then search for a fridge with the words, no future. Once you locate it, collect what you find inside, then call me for further instructions. Till then, I guess. Here to see Rogue, expecting me. Hey, 
rope. I'm back. What about Hellman? Two, please. Make some room. Sit down. Hope you found him. Don't see that often. Determination like yours. Must really need this guy. Matter of life and death. <laughs> Haven't heard that for a while either. Bottle stays. Go ahead. Enjoy. To your health. To yours, kid. Gonna need it. Thanks, Nick. Queen of the afterlife. Who would have thunk? Got a shard for you. Intel. Interesting stuff. Think she'll help? The rogue I remember was one cold-ass bitch. But she usually went with her gut. Something tells me she thinks you check out. Let's see what you got. Your helmet's not on any payroll, not officially anyway. But he does pop up in GNT's confidential stacks. It's a Kang Tao subsidiary, Chinese Corp. Kang Tao's been using them as a fig leaf for years. They're masked for more sensitive operations. All that clear? Must be prepping for a transfer. How would you know? The Chinese Corpo playbook's an open one to me. This looks like the old vanishing pigeon. Decrypted map of upcoming Kang Tao convoy routes. Think Hellman might be in one of them? Thing is, which one? Take a look at the specs on this one. A lone AV, no ground support, no linked cargo manifests either. Weird. Sure, Kang Tao sometimes transports stuff unregistered if they want to push it under the table, but catch the load on this AV. Already approved in the system, but too low. So definitely no cargo on board. Huh. But there's a passenger list. Kang Tao security detail plus one VIP. Transfer from Chan T. Our boy Hellman. That was the good news. There it is. Data's all confidential. You just snap your fingers and it falls in your lap. I know where to look, and I know whose head to put in a vice. Also, hate wasting time, especially answering stupid questions. So what's the bad news? Bad news is the extraction site. Look, Night City airspace. All this. Mm-hmm. No way to jack the transport without the NCPD picking up on it. And here, we're too close to Kang Tao. We even give that AV a dirty look, their backup hustle will be on us. But, right here's Jackson Plains. Narrow corridor, just outside the city, and just out of Kang Tao's reach. Guess it's your lucky day. Dead zone. I'll grab him there. Gonna need a native to the area. Someone who'll set up the op, cobble together the gear. Even tracking that AV will be a bitch. Familiar with the type. Saw legacy models flying around during the war. They're mammoth, but they're quick. Plus, they pack next-gen defenses. Can't take pot shots at it. Not even with serious firepower. Just won't work. It's not about firepower. There are ways, and people who know them. Or who can at least improvise on a theme. So a native. Know any hick mercs? Just one. Pan Am Palmer. She can't count on her clan anymore, but she's a true nomad. She knows those lands. And she will help you. Won't have a choice. Won't have a choice? Does not sound enticing. Not for her, not for me. Enticing comes at a price you can't possibly afford. Can't possibly afford to blow this chance at Navin Hellman. Your operation, your call. Got a bad feeling, V. Strange. I thought nomads gave the city and city folk a wide berth. Varies by clan, by the connections they have, the depth of shit they're in. But you're right. Alda Caldos are rarely willing to do biz with the city. Pan Am's got a different take? Yep, on everything, it seems. Why's Pan Am got to help me? I sense a catch. Pretty big one. Occasionally, Pan Am moves merch for me. Last job? Well... 
wasn't a good day for her. She run into a hitch? Complete bust, actually. Lost the goods and her ride. Pan Am will do anything to get the low back. Means her dignity. I know her. Okay. Guess I can try to help her. But if we don't know where to look, I mean... We do. I do. You know, but wouldn't tell Pan Am. Aim to play cat and mouse with me too? My aim is to know an opportunity when I see one, and then to seize it. Say I told her everything. What do you think she'd have done? Grabbed her iron and gone on the warpath, that's what. Not hard to see how that could end it. And there's nothing I hate more than losing good people to plain stupidity. Huh. I'm her only chance, and she's my only chance. Two pawns on Rogue's board. You're quick. For a pawn. No, oh, Fee. Fine. Let me hear what you know. Rocky Ridge, ghost town just outside Night City. Pan Am knows where. You'll go there, get the merch back. Wheels too. Naturally, you'll call her first. Sending you her deeds. The final. All clear. Thanks. Let's get out of here. Good luck. Jam. Hey. Hang on just a little longer, Chu. Well, Rupert's on the calls. Way. Oh, I, I can't. Hey, Judy. How you feeling? Shitty, but something came to me. Gotta give yourself time to grieve, Judy. Experience all its stages. Feel them. Let them play out. Shock, anger, depression. I'd say I'm on anger. Gonna stay here for a while, too. I can work with anger. So what did you come up with? The Mox Dive, Lizzie's Bar, used to be a joy house. Tiger Claws killed one girl too many, so people took matters into their own hands. Belongs to us now. Clouds could stand to get the same makeover. I'm sure you've thought this through, Judy. Carefully. <laughs> Haven't thought it through at all. All I know is the Mox didn't turn things around by sitting on their tanned and toned asses doing nothing. Got the Mox to agree to take over Clouds. No, I'm trying to get you. Know someone at Clouds will take our side. Will you help? Fine. Got me on board. Oh, yes. Okay, so, what's the plan? First up, we gotta talk to Michael Maeda. If she's not with us, might as well throw our hands up in the air. Michael Maeda. Who is she exactly? Girl who unofficially runs Clouds. Good at it, too. What's she do officially? She's a doll, so she's a nobody. You sure Michael's gonna want to join forces? If I was sure, I'd be on the hollow to her and we wouldn't be having this conversation. Let me rephrase. Is there any chance she'll slap us around then shove us out her mega tower window? Of course, sure. Guess I can work with that. 
How well do you know this Maiko? Too well. When are we doing this? Early morning. Clouds will be closed. Hardly a soul lurking at that time. How early? Before eight. I'll be by the entrance. Oh, scratch that. The balcony above clouds. We'll sneak in. No one needs to know we're there. On the balcony. Got it. Ah, oh, shit. He's in rough shape, but alive. Let's hear what Dennis has to say. Hey, got a status? Find the package? He's a little worse for wear, but no issues. What's next? I prepared a car for you. Put the man in the trunk and head to Northside. The address is in the GPS. Okay. One more thing. Watch for Tigers. They've got their sights trained on your new companion. Wait, 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 what? Ass all hung up. Keep moving, just keep moving. Slaughterhouse. Satisfied your 
in here. Supposed to be here. Here, oh, come on. Job's done. I see that. Well done. Excellent work. Holding in there all right, Hariyoshi? They need to give me hope. Early warning about the Tigers would have been nice. I had a hunch you'd manage this just fine. Given that you're here now, I see I was right. So who is this guy? He'll tell you his story. Hariyoshi? In Japan. Brain sergeant. Top of all, good the instinct. One day, Tiger Crow boss needs surgery, but both die on table. Tiger Crows were very angry. I hide in boat, swim to America. Here, Dennis saved me. But there is secret. I kill Tiger Crow boss on purpose. World best surgeon, make no mistake. This is all very heartwarming, but you haven't paid me yet. I know. Here. May this blade serve you well. What's your name again? Brain Sergeant, World Best. Where are you from exactly? Brain Sergeant, 
ワールドベストグッドインスティンクトはい、はい、ありがとうございます。はい、はい、ありがとうございます。はい、はい、ありがとうございます。
Calm down. Don't tell me what to do. Fine. Know where to find the cargo and your car. You go alone, you won't get him back. And you could lose something else besides. So let's figure something out. What do you want? Need to hit a Kang Tao transport. Won't be easy. Want to know I can count on you. Are you out of your goddamned mind? About you or the job. Kang Tao's AV route will take it over Jackson Plains. Heard that should help us. Yeah, I doubt it. Gonna be a guy on board. Need to talk to him. Fuck. In return, info on your cargo. Help in getting back what's yours. We got a deal? I don't know. I... Shit! All right, deal. But if you want your thing done, we'll need to get my Thornton back first. So where is it? Thought this is mostly about the merch. Fuck the merch. With that ride, I can take any transport job in town. Without it, only thing I can move is pizza. Maybe. Cars in Rocky Ridge. You're supposed to know where that is. Cars there, goods are there. Nash, you dirt-eating bastard. I will strangle you. Nash, you chew me yours? He hang you out to dry? Do not call him that. <laughs> Fine. Partner. Former. If ever. The shift tricked me. He straight nipped my truck and the merch. Probably now aims to sell it off in Rocky Ridge. Is he ever going to be fucking disappointed? Rocky Ridge. Let's go. Uh, hang on. I, I, I should think this through. Fuck. Yes. We'll need backup. We have one brief stop to make on the way. Wanna tell me where? Give me a sec. I should call the client. Convince them to leave the bastard hanging. Going ahead with the deal behind Rogue's back. Brave, I guess. Or fucking dumber than a drum. Buzz! Hey! Nash is gonna pass you the merch in Rocky Ridge. The thing is, the motherfucker screwed me over. Boss, I will take care of it. I just need you to give me a chance. Boss, come on. How many times have I moved things for you? And how many times have I failed? You have my word. After dark? Okay. No, don't call off the meat. Just don't show up. I'll take care of everything. Do you even have to ask? Of course I will. Thanks, boss. You won't regret this. Okay. I have bought us some time. Who the hell's boss? Won't cause us any grief, I hope. Boss is a stand-up guy. Six straight. You drive for gangoons. Is that not allowed? Straight punks need things moved. I need money like anyone else. So... Where to now? The Aldecaldo camp. I need to see some of the old clan. Don't seem too excited. That's not your concern. I still have friends there. Any chance they might help us? In Rocky Ridge? That is the plan. Rogue mentioned your friends. Said you guys stopped seeing eye to eye. Well, since Rogue said so, it must be true. It isn't? You mean to irritate me. Okay, then. It was just a hiccup. They're still family. So it's complicated. You might say so. Yes. Good, let's roll. Get in. Where'd you get the ride? Straight out of some driveway in Rancho? Yes, exactly. Is that a problem? For me? No, not at all. I mean, there's no accounting for taste. Screw you. How far is the camp? Just past the city line. We'll jump on the nine and head east. How the hell did you land in this mess? I liked the color. The air freshener and booster seat came extra. You know I don't mean the car. What am I supposed to tell you? 
That I'm not about to let my partner rob me and get away with it? That my fixer made me look like a goddamn fool? What about you? Why do you need that clown from the AV? This particular clown's got intel I need. And I'm running out of time to get it. So why didn't she tell me she knew about Nash? Rogue? Do better not to wonder what her agenda might be. God damn, I can't stand the bitch! Guess you'll have to ask her yourself. Oh, I'll be sure to. I'll especially ask why she told me to work with Nash, yet forgot to mention he was Raffin. Wait, Nash is Raffin? Yes. He runs with the Wraiths, the largest Raffin group in the area. You know about them, right? Mm hmm. Nomads tossed out of clans. Yes, mostly. Nomads don't banish their own without a reason. So think murderers, rapists, freaks. They gather in teams. Sometimes form actual gangs. Most of them are wanted and have warrants on their heads. Shit. And that bitch had me working with scum like that. I not have known that side of him. So make me laugh. A fixer of her standing knows. And Rogue probably knows we're talking about her right now. Nash and I had a role to play in her game. Her plan. That's it. Rogue's a frigid old bitch. That's the truth. Is that a ghost, or is it just my hangover? Fuck you, too. Mm-hmm. And who's this? My babysitter. V, this is Scorpion. Mitch. Two old friends. Hey, guys. Hello. What brings you to these parts, city girl? The big city got too small for her. Do you have any idea how angry the old man's gonna be when he sees you here? I've just come by for a spell. Saul needn't know a thing. Need your help. With what? What's this about? Raffin screwed Pan Am. Plan is to show him that was a bad idea. How bad did they get you? Bad enough to make me sit quietly through all your bullshit. You know, we would do anything for you, sister. But now? Now's hard. Seriously? You won't help? Uh, well, the old man told us to... Sit tight and get those generators back up after the batteries went kaput. Generators? You won't help because of some goddamn generators? Is this another joke? We'll manage without them. Shut it. Don't be a dick, Mitch. Help me. Not this time. We're needed here. Fuck. I don't believe this. So you'll stay put because Saul told you to. You couldn't care less about me. Pan Am. This isn't about Saul. It's about the clan. You know that. Listen, we can't leave camp. No chance. But... But Saul never said a thing about gear. Okay. Well, I'll need that rifle of yours. And some of my own stuff. Take whatever you want. And take care of yourself out there. Yeah. Thanks, guys. I'll grab the gear, then be out of your hair. Looks like you're stuck with me. Mm-hmm. You disappointed? I don't know. Maybe a little, yes. Hey, Pan Am. Are you staying a while? No, I'll be going again soon. We'll talk next time. Hey, Pat. Hey, Pan Am. Have you brought someone new? Want to see what you got in stock. But I was to your heart content.
Have you brought someone new? Does Saul know? Not your concern, friend. Will you help me with this? What's inside? A few odds and ends that should be useful. Take it. All right, that's everything. Let's go. Did you figure out your differences with Saul? Will you come back? Pan Am, you'll stop by later, right, honey? Next time, Ellie. I promise. So, I'm off. Yeah, yeah, go on, go already. Call us sometime. Keep an eye on her, V. Sure. Put it in the trunk. Sure. We can go. Hop in. So, Rocky Ridge. Empty, dusty hole in the middle of bumfuck nowhere out here. Natives either moved to Night City or just got the hell out. Then you know almost all there is to know. The whole area was waiting on a new interstate extension. It was supposed to breathe new life into the town. It didn't happen, of course. How many ghost towns do you think are there? Hundreds? Countrywide? Thousands. I drove down I-80 the other day. All you have to do is pull over after sundown. It's quiet then. And you hear it. What's that? The wind whistling through boarded up windows. Tumbleweeds scratching across dry, sandy tracks. That's how towns die. Not with a bang. But with whispers and whimpers. Were those two in the army? Scorp and Mitch? Yeah. Panzer boys. They're on contract during the last war. Panzer boys. Flew those huge transporters. Scorpion piloted. Mitch ran security. They both got some kick-ass combat implants and a stack of really fucked up nightmares. Mitch and Scorpion seem good souls. The best friends a girl could ask for. I'd stay in the camp, too, if I were in their shoes. Fuck Saul and his generators, of course. Yet the clan comes first. But I'm not part of it anymore. Still treated you like you're one of them. They care about you. Mm-hmm. Do you have anyone you would call close? Haven't been so lucky. I see. Seems you got a real problem with authority. What? Rogue, Saul. He your leader? Their leader. Seemed in a hurry to delta the hell out of there. Let's just say Saul wouldn't have been happy to see me. What happened? <sighs> the reason we came to California was because he promised change for the Alda Caldos. He claimed we would turn over a new leaf. But you saw it. We got a handful of tents on a heap of sand. A hell of a promised land. I wanted something different. Better. Saul's a damned coward. He'll be the end of the clan, I'm certain. Okay. We have arrived. What do we do? We get ready to greet the Raffins. And we've little time for that. We'll need to improvise. We should scout first, to look for anything that might be useful. What happened here? My name is El Got someone 3 o'clock. Speed 500. Sorry, 50. I'll be, be there in 5, 7, okay let's roll you
Need not tick the station roof, I'll cut the bio shack. Boo shack. Oh, oh. Decline and smaller has at last reached its new golden age. As good fortune would have it, the city's numerous landfills abandoned buildings. from your own personal family archives. Don't waste another minute. Pre-order Silver Days now to receive a 10% discount. And I wish you all a bright and shiny day. Thanks for tuning in to WNS News. But we cannot forget, corporations are Night City's largest tax base. Contributing... Down Rocky Ridge. Could be any debtor. Everything's down. Nothing works here. Well, have you found anything? Hey guys, nothing's up. All cut off. Oh, we'll make it work. The Raffins will roll in after dusk. We will have a surprise ready for them. We just need to get some power flowing. Let's check the substation. Okay. Found the breakers, but there's no juice on them. Not to worry. Come down. I know how to surprise the bastards. Right. So, the intersection is powered from that transformer substation, right? The switch gear on the roof. We'll flip the switch there and everything will light up like Christmas. 
Understood? Fine idea. Let's get us some power. I'll look around for access points. Great. They're likely to show up in numbers. We can't know how many. We need to outfox them, then get to my car somehow. Relax. Got a few ideas. I'll try to play a little game with them at the intersection. Hell yes. Perfect. As soon as they see the lights, they'll have to check who, why, and how. Nova. Yep. First we start up the control terminal below. The gear on the roof is a hunk of junk without it. Come on, we'll give it a boost from the car battery. That should do the trick. Wait for me by the substation. I'll bring the car around. The panel looks to be in good shape. I'll make a bypass circuit to the power supply. That should do it. We'll just have to get it up and running. Grab the jumper cables from the trunk. We'll boost it from the car battery. Red cable connected. Give me a moment. I need to hook everything up here. And done. Now the Black Rattler. There she goes. Thought the old jalopy served us well. Okay, I've got voltage. Start the terminal inside. And once the power is on in the building, get on that roof. You got it. I'll set up on the tower. We'll have the whole intersection on a platter. You flip the breakers when I give you the signal to do so, understood? Yes, ma'am. Which gear's got power? Prime. We'll have some fun at the intersection. Let's get into position. Now we wait. Remember, as soon as we see them, you give us power. Raffins will come from where? Any idea? The northeast, I wager. From the freeway that was never finished. Got it. Cover me, just in case. Of course. They're rolling in. And my thorn. You see her? 
really, really hard to miss. Let's take them by surprise. Let's try to do this quietly. If anything happens, I'll start picking them off. Sound good? Sounds great. starts now. Fuck me. Turn on the goddamn power. Grab the car, Sean. The driver has it. For the girl with the mohawk. Colorful bunch. I'll take the wheel. Sure, sure. Leave the driving to the pros. At last. And? She's prime wheels, isn't she? Dreamy indeed. I'm surprised you wanted her back. She completes me. See? Managed just fine without Mitch and Scorpion. Listen, V, it's not over yet. It's not? You got the cargo, you got your car. I did not get Nash, who was not in Rocky Ridge. The fucker didn't show. And I am. Listen, I have a plan. And I don't care. The car and the merch, that's what we were after. We got them. 
Six Street away Just toward, listen and I... to me, for fuck's sake! I know where their little hidey hole is. We'll take the old unfinished freeway nearby. They will not be expecting us. I'm sure of it. Wanna just show up at the RAF and hideout? Are you out of your mind? Do you have a better idea? Let me hear it. Matter of fact, I do. We take the stuff to 6th Street, then go after Hellman like we planned. I gave you my word, didn't I? Please stop writing my ass about Hellman. And do not start acting high and mighty, like you won't lift a finger if it's not in the contract. Just, just help me get Nash. <sighs> All right. So where's this hideout? A hop and skip away. Thanks. What Nash did. <clears throat> I placed my trust. He was the first person I worked with after leaving the Alda Calvins. After I came to Night City. And I granted him my trust. I get it. I know how you feel. Had someone betray me just like that once. And did you make them pay? Never got the chance. Someone else got to him first. But if they had it, would you have done it? There's one thing I've learned in Night City. It's that sometimes revenge is not sweet. Always stand to lose more than you might gain. I don't think I'll ever play by Night City rules. Are you ready? Let's get him.
Hello, Rose. Pan Am. What did you say again? Solve your own problems? Clean up your shit? Nash is dead. One shit clean. Happy. And the Sixth Street merch? Nash can't deliver it anymore. But if you ask nicely, I might be able to help. Thing with Rogue. Let it go, maybe? Why should I? Because she's not worth another goddamn minute of your time. Let's go. That broke. Think she might have lost the plot. Mean to say she used to be sweet and alluring? <laughs> Never that. But she's no stranger to the other end of the stick. Think she might need a nice strong shock. Hey boss. Got your cargo. No, no fast ones. Come on, let's meet. Sunset mode. I know you're not kidding. I'm certain to be there. Okay, I arranged our meeting. Let's do the deal and start working on Hellman. Agreed? Sunset Motel, what's that? A safe spot. It's not far from here. Sixth Street not likely to pull anything. I've driven for them before. Never had them do anything strange. I'm hoping they know what's good for business. Should be fun. They're here. Let me do the talking. Sensing trouble? No. At least I don't think so. Hey, boss. Pan Am. How's Nash? Didn't seem to be answering his phone. Don't call him anymore. There's no need. <laughs> you got balls, girl. What's this? A bonus of some sort? A partner. There. First class merch. Mm hmm. So, everything's in order? Should be pretty plush in a couple of minutes. It's been a pleasure. But I believe Rogue's the one who is to pay me. You're all right. Think you were. Let's roll. That went well. Come on. Let's get a drink. Raffin's wife, Six Street's pleased. Pretty good day for Pan Am Palmer. The day's not over yet. You still have a chance to piss me off. Hello, Noah. 
Hey, new biz or new friends back there? Take a wild guess. Is everything good with you? Did those bozos come around again? Raffins? Nah, it's been quiet. They'll be back, sure enough. This place has seen worse. What can I get you? Frozen. Two of them. So that package for Street, what was it? You didn't pee? Valoperidol. Drugs for the cyber psychos in our midst. They trade in them? Yes. They have deals. With black clinics, rippers. Cheers. Here's to what's yet to come. To what's to come. Another one over here. Thanks, Noah. Cheers. Let me know if you need anything else. The Raffins. We done with them? Oh, no. The Shiver cockroaches. One's never rid of them. But it should be quiet for a time. They'll need to gather their wits and dust themselves off. Yell the Kalbos. Think he'll ever go back? I mean, not right now, but someday? I don't rightly know. On the one hand, I don't have anyone outside the clan. Shit, I don't really know any other life. But on the other? Without my clan, who am I? Who would I become if I stayed in Night City? Could you start over again? That's what I did. Mm hmm For now, I only seem to be really good at burning bridges. Talking about Rogue? No, but thanks for reminding me. V, do you think I can make a fresh start with her, too? She seems to better at ease on the right people. You'll work it out. All right. Time we look to my needs. What's the plan for Hellman? I've come up with a plan. A first draft. But I need to sleep on it. Work it out. Then we can talk about the details. I think it best to rent rooms here. Just to stay in the area. We'll get to work around midnight. It'll help keep us out of sight. Agreed? You know what? What do you say we meet back here later? Got things to do in town. Whatever you want. All you stand to miss is some real strong, real awful coffee. Noah, I'll need a room. Just for tonight. Catch you later. Yeah. My name is Dakota Smith. If you're looking for jobs out here, you will find them with me. Name's V. Thanks for the intel. Things look differently out here. Keep your head on, city kid. Carrying. World. Firearms.
You have nothing better to do? job the urgent kind someone is yanking my friend's drones out of the sky check out the coordinates find out who is responsible the details are attached
I think every smartass would have encrypted their comms by now. Anyway, what's the matter? Raffenschiff bought a virus Shit. and they're broadcasting it around via an aerial transmitter. Wasn't there an antenna around here? Uh huh. Not for much longer, it won't be. Nice work on that antenna. The tricky part of having a head is knowing how to use it, but not for you. Mosquitoes. Boots are safe and secure again. The contract is closed, and closed well.
Simpson. We chat on occasion. Well then, you really are a special. <laughs> Left are crooked as a bag of snakes. Are you ready to go? Born that way. And you? Sleep well? Like a baby on a bumpy road. Come up with anything? For Hellman, I mean. As a matter of fact, I did. Look here. Tell me. We're the wrench. The cutter is the AV. And the screwdriver is where the AV should bury its nose cone in the dust. Now, you must be wondering how we get the AV to do that. That old HMG of yours. My gun will be useful elsewhere. This caliber would barely dent the armor of a heavy hitter like that. There are other ways. Here, the clamps are solution. A satwave power station. Power station. Wait, you want to use an EMP? Bullseye. But how? We can't generate that sort of pulse on command. Would you like to bet me? We drive up to the power collection unit, break in and override the controls, lift any limiters. As soon as the AV is in range, we set off the electromagnetic turbo pulse. This should smoke the AV system. The drive, nav systems, communications, everything out like a light. They won't stand a chance in hell. Remember, need Hellman alive, unharmed. Gotta try not to blow the AV to bits, okay? I know, but I'd say your man had best be buckled in. This idea, if it works, you'll be in for a rough landing. All right, let's ride. Great, hop in. It's cold out here. Who owns this power station? Gov or Corp? Is there any difference? Who do you think pulls the government's strings? Hey, I'm just wondering whose toes we're about to step all over. V, look around. It is simple. Everything you see is owned by a corporation. You like to mess with the corpse, huh? Whatever gave you that idea. Or wait, scratch that. Rogue, Nash. Raffins. You're on thin ice, B. You just like to mess with everyone. Well, then I suppose it's a good thing I'm on your side, isn't it? Mm -hmm. And now for something completely different. Weirdest thing you've ever transported. Go. What? Are we playing 20 questions? Come on, answer. The deputy finance director of Calcas. That's chauffeuring, not smuggling. He rode in the trunk. Flatlined. Really? Dead? A long story. Maybe someday I'll tell you. We've almost reached the dam. We'll make a quick stop here. Need to calibrate you with a turret. I want you to be able to use the gun too. It should up our chances in general. 
Connect here. How should I connect? Personal link? How else? Just watch the jack. Sometimes you have to jig a little bit. Wired in. Wait a moment. Diagnostics first. Shit, it keeps giving me an error. Odd. Let me work around it. And now, Pan Am, here's Johnny. Out in the middle of bumfuck nowhere. Great work, V. Hey, uh, I think your implant has a virus. The one in the nape of your neck. Uh, I've got a bioprocessor in my head that operates independently of me. Probably why your diagnostics flagged it. Mm-hmm. Okay. But no data will leak out of it through the personal link. Your ride's secure. Fine. I trust you won't fuck anything up. Okay. Here goes nothing. See that pile of junk? Fire a short burst into it. I'll take care of the calibration. Good. Next target. Single shot. Okay. Just one more. Longer round. Now that wasn't so bad, was it? Calibration's fine, but your soft could really use an update. Scanning the controllers. All a couple of generations back, at least. Got a tech in the bargain bin at a Kabuki flea market. I can help you with that, you know. Yes, sure. The most important thing is that it works now. So where's this power station? You will see in a moment. I know a spot. We'll have a decent view from there. I just want to be sure the area is clear. Sabotage a Corpo power station. Jump a Corpo transport. Kidnap a Corpo suit. This a plug for the word Corpo, or do you have a point? Know what? You're starting to remind me of me. Fifty years back. Minus the charisma. An impressive cock. Hmm. Maybe we can just get along. Could be something to that, I suppose. What happened to us? It must have had some effect. You're more like me than you think. You'll see. But it goes both ways. Maybe you're becoming more like me. Nah, no way. All looks clear. The area looks deserted. I see no patrols. The huge thing is the collection unit. And see the antennas? Each antenna collects microwave energy from satellites in orbit. That's then converted into electric power. Power stations serve the whole city? Honestly? Who the fuck knows? Guess we're about to find out. Antennas run a ways down the interstate. We set off a chain reaction that starts in the collection unit. Then each antenna will emit a massive EMP burst. While our AV flies right into our net. We just have to send out the pulse at the right moment. Let's go get her. When we arrive at the station, you overload the systems. I'll set up a bypass link for the detonator. Why don't I start with the transformers? Make mayhem in the relative voltages. Rest should move faster after that. Not a bad idea. That's just... Yeah, yeah, I know, the converters. But they shouldn't be a problem. I'll just crank everything up past max. Seems we think alike. So what now? We wait. We should time our arrival to the AV flight plan. Got it. Good. Time to roll. Done anything like this before? Downing an AV? By myself? No. Why do you ask? Seems Rogue was right. V... What? She said you were good and she was right. Yes. I suppose she was. We have yet to take the AV, so you might wait before you fasten a halo on her. Know what? I think I figured you out. Oh, you have? Have you? Either pull off this mission or prove Rogue wrong. Choose one. Fuck off. I will get both done.
Okay, we'll be there in a moment. One last time. We drive in, fuck up the system, and get the hell out of there. Hold on tight. This could get a little bumpy. Get ready. Okay, I'm ready. <laughs> Deal with them. Deal quick before they hit us. Get rid of those drones, V. What do you think I'm doing? Do it better. before something happens to the chimp. Answer the tip. You know, I was just about to set up a picnic. Maybe lay out. Work on my mean, best hand. Watch out. The next one might. Johnny? Johnny? Fucking hell. Okay. I'm fine. It's... It's okay. Just... It's okay, I'm fine. Yeah. Just dealt to the fuck out. Not the cleanest job, perhaps, but it still went well. What about the detonator? Is it working? Yes, it's working. And I don't even see a drop in the signal strength. We just need to drive far away enough to keep the pulse from blasting us, too. The cliff there. We'll set up. It should give us a good view of the antennas. And then we wait. Okay. Always wanted to push the big red button on something like this. How do we know when? Don't worry, I'll have eyes on it. You just wait for my signal, then set off that pulse. They won't know what hit them. And by the way... What? We are about to knock a multi-million euro dollar Kang Tao asset clean out of the sky. How does that make you feel? Blasting shit. Exactly what the doc ordered. And that's exactly what I like to hear. Just noticed. What? It's quiet. The hum of the city, people's voices, the smells. It's all gone. Wind just intensifies it. Think I forgot quiet exists. Mm-hmm. Though maybe not the smells. I mean, the coyotes. Rather hard to miss. Thought that was just the air freshener in your Thornton. Ha ha. Screw you. You'd do better to focus on the AV. Keep your eyes open.
It's there, coming from Pacifica. All right, get ready. One more second. One more. Now. Boom. There she is. Shit. What's, What's going happening? on? God damn it all. Fucking hell. Bullseye. Pan Am, the engines are still running. Fuck, they're getting away. They're going nowhere. We gotta go after it. Give me a moment. Pan Am, what are you doing? That's how you do it. It's losing altitude. We got the bastard. Let's go. No way it stays in the air after a blast like that. We either land or crash. You catch that? Over. EV unmarked. Losing out. Fetch! There? Scorpion! What the hell are Finishing they doing? Finishing up at the generators. Follow them. On my way in a bit. Battery Mitch, should sort Scorpion, itself out. It's Pan Am! Don't go near that AV! I repeat, do not approach the AV! Uh -huh. On the way, or I'll start the party without you. It's Kang Tao! Wait for me! Or better, get the hell out! They probably want to help the survivors without knowing it's corporate. They can't hear me. The pulse is interfering. Shit. I have three on radar. Drones? Yes. Get ready. They're trying to slow us down. We won't let them. We have to race with Scorpion. You can manage. Sure. I'll live. Don't worry. Hey man, where are you? Hello? Mm -hmm. Perfect. Scorpion. Keep broadcasting over an open channel. Just in case they missed you the first time. God, I swear. Something's not right. Did you hear those shots? V, something happened to them. Let's check it out. I see the wreck, but no scorpion. Or me. We'll scan the area. We have to get our bearings. Let's roll. You connecting to visual? Mm-hmm. V, if they got the Alticaldus, if they got Mitch and Scorpion, I can't... I don't... No, I know. Connected. I'm in control. Sorry. 
clan? All to Caldos. Yes. They're dead. All of them. V, if they... Don't worry. We don't know for sure. Fucking corporate rat! Mitch! He's alive! They have them! They've set up the launcher. They'll tear us to shreds if we get too close. Can we take it down somehow? Maybe. But we have to get there first. Five Kangs on patrol. Combat drones. Defense systems active. If not for those damn things, I could have warned them. This is all my doing. Why in the hell were they following the AV? The fools! Listen, we saw Mitch. They probably got Scorpion too. We'll find them. Help them out. If they're still alive. They're alive. Everything's gonna be okay. Mind that launcher. It will blow us to bits if we approach. You're already blown to bits. Don't be an idiot. This is just a scratch. Let's take out the launcher. I will try no, to- No, you stay in the car. Sorry, but you're just gonna slow me down. Fucking hell, V. Those are my people out Listen, there. I get that launcher out of the way, I'll let you know. Then you go in and help me with the rest. Deal? Yes, sir. I still have Mitch's rifle. I will try to cover you from here. Good idea. Let's move.
Toss your weapons, or I'll shoot. I repeat, drop your weapons, now! Easy now. Not too late for everyone to walk out of this alive. We called for backup! Bullshit! Last chance. You don't gotta die today. Let's talk. Why should I believe you? Pan Am, shoot Shut him. up. Listen, this isn't about you. Let him go and tell me where I, your passenger is. I, I don't know where they took him. Hell no. He's lying. No. You don't know or you don't want to say. Let me get the comms back up. I'll buzz the unit. We'll talk. Pan Am. But only if you remember the Shut cowboy, the fuck don't up. you? Fuck. Pan Am. Oh, shit. Are you all right? Uh, just some scratches. You fucking morons! Did you get hit? Hang on, girl. I'll patch it's you up. It's nothing. Let's go. We couldn't retreat. They regrouped so fast. Started shooting rockets and shit. I lost everyone. Everyone? Scorpion. Is he here? Mitch? He's dead. Mitch? He's... He's safe, right? I am. I'm sorry. I didn't make it in time. No. No. Are you sure? No, he... Scorpion, the rest. I'm sorry we didn't get here sooner. They were good people. Great people. They didn't have to die here. I should have stopped him. I tried. He wouldn't have listened to you either. Never was much of a listener. Stubborn bastard. I'm guessing since you were out here, you were out here for the AV. The question is why? Why dive straight for the AV? Didn't notice the markings? We saw it was damaged. We know this land. We knew where it would fall. We had no idea it was Kang Tao. I figured they might need help. In the worst case, there'd be good salvage to be had. Couldn't have been more wrong. Everything okay? You need anything? Thanks for saving my ass, V. Sorry about your people, but I need to keep moving. I need the guy who's riding this AV. You know anything, see anything. Took him with him. In our cars. Where? West, small unit, your passenger's entourage. Must be looking for a way to call base. So you're the ones who hit him with that EMP? Yeah, we tried to warn you, but couldn't connect. If they took your cars, we might be able to follow their tracks. I'll go after him. Stay with Mitch, I'll be fine. I am going with you. I promised I would help. Besides, those bastards killed Scorpion. I won't let that go. Don't argue with her, V. No point. Go. I'll call my people. We'll take care of things here. We'll leave my ride here just in case. Just watch the gun. It likes the We'll go by bike. Sounds solid. <laughs> I lost contact with their AV. Probably looking for it. Better hurry. But Pan Am. What? You're coming back for her, right? I promise. Let's get going before they send a rescue party. Scorpion and the rest. Look, I know how you feel. I mean it. I'll help you settle your score with Kang Tao. I will destroy them, V. Every last one. We're in this together. To the bitter end. You know what, V? You're all right. You helped me with Nash. You helped me with Mitch. To my mind, I owe you a favor. Your Hellman. I will find him. Ah, so that's what this is? Just paying your debts? No. Nomads always help their own. <laughs> oh, so I'm one of yours now. Sounds good. Let's ride. Hope they didn't go. Nice talking to you. <laughs> Let's ride. Hope they didn't go far. We'll see. The tire tracks start there. We'll follow them. Our guys were here. Let's follow. Find them.
Scorpion said I would hate Night City. I knew you that well. Probably got a million for myself. He said when I had enough of the city, we would stock up on can and kibble, fill a couple of thermoses with coffee and whiskey, and then the road. He said we would get away from it all. Sounds like a real adventure. Just come out! The rest must have taken Helm with Lip them. Dicks. If they manage to regroup and pull for help, run. Better hurry then. Left a few peeps behind at the airstrip. The rest went with Helm. They're coming for him, don't worry. set up shop here. I see. They must have Hellman locked up somewhere. Buffy, see that? The pumps look pretty good. Not what you would find if the place were closed. The bastards might have managed to call for transport. 
We'll know soon enough.
Don't shoot. I'm unarmed. What the hell are you doing here? This is my station. Name's Marty. Those fucking suits rode up like they own the place. Took everything. Put me here and locked the door. Brought a man with them. A man I need. Civilian. You must have spotted him. Mm-hmm. I ain't blind. Where are they holding him? Old garage. Room upstairs. Probably keeping them there. Thanks. I were you, I'd stay put for a few. Exactly my intention. Know where they're keeping Hellman. Going in. Okay. Covering you. Do you even get any customers out of here? Shit, anyone even drive this way? Anyone who don't like refueling with cameras watching them? Not many, sure, but they're all big tippers. You get me? In exchange... Right, I'm out. Who are you working for? You're in Obu Arasaka. Do you wish to take me back home? Pathetic rat's got nowhere left to scurry off to. He's out of lifelines. Shut him up already. Not a fan, I take it. You haven't found a fan in him either. Motherfucker doesn't know who to be scared of more. You or Arasaka. Don't take this personally. I seem to recall you were gonna tell Takamura when you got Hellman. Yeah, just a sec. I'll call him. Just remember, you have Hellman, and that's one hell of a card. Try to win something with it. Takamura saved my life, remember? Because it was in his fucking interest to do so. Still just biz. He's no friend of yours. Takamura, good news. Got Hellman. Alive. What did he say? Alive, alive. Not too talkative now. Taking him to the Sunset Motel. I will come to you. Keep him there until I arrive. You got it. See ya. Better take him somewhere you can talk in peace. True. Looks like your new Chimbas are here. Is that him? Sure is. Take him outside. Toss him on the bike. Stay right there. The cavalry has arrived. Mitch gathered together a few elder Kelvins. <clears throat> the road was clear. I don't think we were spotted. We would still do better not to hang around too long. What do you plan to do with him? Just gotta ask him a few important questions. 
I sure hope you get some important answers. Saul. Everything's done here. All clear. I heard Mitch is alive thanks to you. Thanks to V and Pan Am. They both saved my ass. I just hope he was worth it. Saul, I tried to raise Scorpion, but he... Maybe I could help out somehow? I think you've helped enough. I tried to stop him. Sure. Just turn around now. Let it all be damned. You're good at that, aren't you? Look, Saul. It really wasn't Pan Am's fault. Careful. You and me are not buddy-buddy. Besides, nobody's blamed anyone for anything yet. Sure. Right. Pan Am was just helping me. It was my doing. My fault that A.V. got hit. Without me, Scorpion and his people wouldn't have gone out to grab it. That's the truth. When you're in Aldo Caldo, you were always responsible for yourself and your people. The circumstances change nothing. Perhaps Pan Am should ask herself if she's still in Aldo Caldo. Damn it all! Glad to see you, Mitch, but why'd you even come? Saul, he came with our people. We took care of the bodies, I told him what happened, and he told us to up and follow you. He was worried something would happen to you, to Pan Am. Saul? Look, maybe you two don't see eye to eye at the moment, but you're family, and Saul will do anything for family. The thing is, am I even part of the family anymore? You know you are. Come back to us. I understand. Sorry you had to witness that. Things just get complicated. Dramatic sometimes. But I will manage. And you. You look out for yourself, all right? So, what now? Back to Night City? Yeah. I mean, I think so. I have to sit and think. About everything. I think that's it. Until next time. They're coming. You got a minute. Let's move! Until next time. Take care of Scorpion's bike. It's yours now. What is this place? Motel, middle of nowhere. Any specific middle? Doesn't matter. You're not leaving here by yourself anyway. Why are we here? Want to talk about your little invention. Biochip you make for our soccer. Fine. But let's get one thing straight first. Yorinobu Arisaka didn't send you? No. This means you must have an offer for me. If your boss will pay more than Kang Tao, I believe we can talk. Nobody sent me. I got a problem, and you're gonna help me. And what does that have to do with the biochip? Got Silverhand's construct in my head. It's literally driving me crazy, and I know it's only gonna get worse. That is, unless I remove it. And that, none of that's on the billboards I saw. Not even in the fine hand. Construct, that's impossible. Where did you get this biochip? Clept it off Yorinobu Arasaka. Job for a client. But the client left me out of And drive. you decided the best place for it was in your own goddamn head. Actually, wasn't a bad idea. Construct rebooted me when my own goddamn head took a bullet. I always knew Yorinobu's plan would fail. I just never imagined it would turn out like this. Arisaka's prized tech really is in the very streets of the city. You have to remove the biochip from my system. It's not that simple. Look, you made the thing, didn't you? So where's the problem? If you're telling the truth, you slotted in a new experimental version of the biochip. I know you can't just yank it out. My Ripper you said- You showed that to some fucking street doctor? Who else knows? I needed help. 
Or did you think the first thing that came to mind was down in a Kang Tao AV? How's the prototype version different? It's got a different engram, something more... Aware. Aggressive. The biochip is what's unique, not Silverhand's engram. The previous version of the chip was only used to communicate with pre-saved And it was rare as fuck and cost a fortune. Yeah. This one's rarer. Meant to install and activate the engram in a new body. When I left Arisaka, the project was still in the trial phase. How do you put a price on immortality? Who could even afford tech like this? Nobody. This model was meant to remain in-house. The prototype was Saburo Arisaka's personal commission. He oversaw the entire project himself. So if it weren't for Yorinobu, nobody would have found out. And if not for you, the project would not have been a success. This is a true breakthrough. How exactly was this new version supposed to work? Were you planning to have the engram kick people out of their own bodies? Is that shit by design? During the tests, we assumed that the body would be neurally indifferent during implantation. You mean dead? Yes, which makes what happened to you interesting indeed. Huh, imagine my luck. So fucking unique, so fucking exceptional. That mean you'll help me? Well, well. I would have to see it first. Okay. Hmm. Unbelievable. It looks like... I can't believe this Seuss the one who's gonna help us. Oh, fuck. What? What is it? What a pity I won't be able to examine it fully. Yeah, real shame. You could have been his guinea pig, too. Tell me how to get rid of it. I'm afraid I have bad news. Your neural network has completely deteriorated. It can no longer function independently of the chip. The only thing I could... Woohoo, it's bargaining time. ...is to give you information on a good clinic in Sweden. They'll help you through the terminal stages. Minimize the pain. Wait, you said the project was in the trial phase. You don't actually know how it'll end. Oh, I do. I just saw the construct devouring your brain. It's programmed to take over its new environment. At all costs. And your little meat brain is helpless against it. So no matter what, sooner or later the engram wins. Yes. From what I've heard about Silverhand, that seems to be exactly his style. Huh. I see my reputation's grown into Arasaka legend. What exactly is going on in my head? You tell me, what's it like to have two personalities? Because it's not like you're hearing voices. You are both yourself and Silverhand simultaneously. I can see him and talk to him. You're not talking, but yes, I understand what you mean. Have you noticed the Construct's influence on your decision-making? Sheesh, give it a rest. When it comes to my decisions, Johnny really is just a voice in my head. Maybe he has a different opinion, but he can't make me do anything. Agreed 100%. You are one fucking stubborn It's not host. as if one of you wins the debate. The scale simply shifts. Slowly but surely. What do you mean? You will start doing things that were once unthinkable, at least to your old self. And you know exactly who he was. A fanatic. A terrorist. A suicide bomber. Well, fuck me. Who's trying to mess with your head now? That is why I believe it would be better for you to consider clinical isolation at this stage. At least Johnny never whored himself out like you. Are you defending him? Or is that Johnny speaking now? Oh, let me guess. He already tried to take over your body. You know, just for a little while. No. Would you, though? Could be fun. Johnny. Kidding. But watch out. Suit's getting ready to talk your head off. You know what? That's enough. You just playing for time? Because I can't tell. Are you trying to convince me you're useless? 
Because, I mean, in that case, I can just shoot you in the head and save us both some time. Ah, oh, finally. I will try to help you. If you come with me to Kang Tao. I'll try, just isn't gonna cut it. Actually, it's almost like you're trying to buy your way in with the Chinese. At my expense. Do you even realize how much data is in your head? Even if I can't help you, the data must be saved. Well, fuck me sideways. What a half-brain god. Get Kang Tao. Got any other ideas? If you think there's anyone else who can help you, I could give you the blueprints. Complete project documentation. Kang Tao offered quite the sum for it. You got it with you? He's got to gonk's fucking useless without him. V. Hey. Takamura? What the hell is he doing here? He's got a few questions of his own for you. You play nice, he might even save your ass. I'm almost done. The blueprints. Better than nothing. Long as we find someone fluent in techno babble. What will you do with him? I haven't decided yet. Are you serious? You know me. I can be impulsive. He's all yours. I'll give you two some space. I hope. Come to an understanding. That is certainly in your best interest. V, I will remember this. Ah, this heat. My throat is positively parched. Mm. V did not give you even a glass of water. Unacceptable. Inhuman. That is not me. You will see the difference. I will give you full buckets. No, uh, no need. See that? Fuck me, just look at that. Ah! Sons of bitches. You really are paranoid. You don't see it? Way corpse are stripping our world and lives naked, piece by piece? Can't turn a blind eye to that. Whatever you gotta say, say it. Got something eating at your code, that's clear. Been trying to learn how you're wired this whole time. To know who I'm dealing with. Thought you were just unlucky at first. But I kept watching, and finally realized what your problem is. Always been a corpo cog, a replaceable part. One sucker booted you out, stripped you of perks. Best you could hope for was to be a scav exterminator. You sure seem to know a lot about my past. Well, seen flashes of your past, just like you've seen flashes of mine. Honestly, I'm scared of the day I'll start seeing your memories as my own. Shit. If it's a two-way street, I'll somehow have to live with the fact that I let Deshaun best me. Fuck me over. How you find life under my skin? Well, most things are either too big or too small. Not to mention the clusterfuck that are your hormones. And the lag between sight and touch. Infuriating. When you take a bite of pizza, it takes ages before I know you fucking burn the roof of your mouth. Plus, used to be five minutes wouldn't pass before I had a fresh cig in my hand. Now I'm itching for nicotine. Getting used to it, I guess. But it's no fucking picnic. So listen, will, will I notice a change, or is it one of those things where I wonder why I ever feared it? Worst thing you can do to a human, rip their identity out of them. That's all I know. Can you just tell me what you want? 
what you really want. Help me settle my score against Arasaka. That's it. Your goal is to bury Arasaka. Demolish it. Mine's to stay above ground. Seem pretty clearly defined, both. Actually align pretty nicely, too. You need Mikoshi to save your life? That done, I can burn it to the ground. There it is. The Crusade. Get to Mikoshi, smash the system. Okay. I'll tell you why I want to destroy Arasaka, but I'll only tell you once. Want to hear it? All right. I saw a corpse strip farmers of water, and eventually of land. Saw them transform Night City into a machine fueled by people's crushed spirits, broken dreams, and emptied pockets. Corps have long controlled our lives, taken lots, and now they're after our souls. V, I've declared war not because capitalism's a thorn in my side or out of nostalgia for an America gone by. This war's a people's war against a system that spiraled out of our control. It's a war against the fucking forces of entropy. Understand? Do whatever it takes to stop them, defeat them, gut them. If I gotta kill, I'll kill. If I need your body, I'll fucking take it. Fucking hell. Johnny, take a sec. You we still gotta... don't see it, but you will one day.